Órale. Charo ganado a little bit ago, eh? Driving up, I'd seen them. I seen them coming off their bed. I bail off, I grabbed my bow and I started putting a stock on them. Came out of this little this tall grass creek bottom and I I'm going to give me some jerky. I was watching my hands in the little pond hanging my hanging my garden in the tree. I hear the toro bull, toro bugle up here. Let's see what we see. down he ran through here and crashed right down there it's not a giant toro that's gonna be some some good carne from that toro Let's go check it out eh Hunger on that tree. There he is, eh? Toro down. Sitting here washing up from cleaning my bowl. Little baby ragger. <laughs> Six by comes in, maybe eight yards. Hey, that's hunting. What's up, everybody? It's me again, your favorite bow hunting cholo. And yes, it's been a little while. That's why I have something extra special for you today. As we get started into the early season this season, I want to give you 13 tips to help you be more successful as you go on with this fall. Tip number one, don't forget the SD card in the freaking truck, eh? Because in your camera, stays in your backpack, eh? Pendejo. Orale. Tip number two, when you head out into the woods, make sure you do the best job you can 
to blend in with your surroundings okay make sure you mash and you look as as blended in as possible so that way the venados and the toros they don't see you you know what i mean hey it's a good match right there chulo tip number three don't talk like you're eating a burrito that's rude tip number four make sure you check your wet wipes before you hit the mountains eh the wet wipes were not so wet You're a big toro, you gotta hunt where there's big toros. Orale. Point in tip number six. When you're hunting in the woods, make sure you have a good pair of boots. Like this one's here. Right here. Make sure you have some good boots. Orale. Point in tip number seven. Always prepare a celebration meal. Orale. Orale. Point in tip number eight. Always make sure you keep your carne clean and cool. Orale, bow hunting tip number nine. Next time you go get you a new bow, make sure you get you one of these rubber leg gripper thingies. So that way when you're hiking in the woods, you get a little bit tired, eh? You can go ahead and put your leg gripper thingy on your leg and strike a pose, look all chingon, you know? Bow hunting tip number 10. Never forget your chapstick. Holy cheap, my lips are cracked, eh? Orale. Bow hunting tip number 11. I don't have no, no history with this toro, eh? So I don't have a name for him. But if you're taking your season chasing the two-legged toes, make sure you don't forget their name, eh? 